Here's another silverware trick that you can do at a restaurant, family gathering, whatever you'd like. Grab a spoon. Set the spoon down on a napkin. Now I like to use these cloth napkins. Uh, paper napkins will also work in a pinch, but the cloth napkins work the best. You'll see why in a minute. Take a spoon. You set the spoon in the middle of the napkin. Grab the spoon. You wrap it up in the napkin, nice and neat. Easy enough, when I open it, the spoon has now changed into a fork. Very easy to do. Here's what's happening. Underneath the napkin is the fork. The fork goes right across the middle of the napkin. You take the spoon. You set the spoon down beside the fork. This is why a cloth napkin works better. A paper napkin will work, but you could see through it. And with silverware, it's not as effective if you can see it underneath. It kind of ruins it. But you set the spoon down beside the fork, not on top, or else you'll get a clanky noise. Set the spoon down. You grab both of them with your hand and roll them. I have them both. I'm rolling. Try to keep it nice and even. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Now you'll get to this point where you have two little triangles. Here's what you do. Take the entire packet, flip it over. Done. When you pull those, you've just flipped over the napkin and now the fork appears. Have fun. I'm going to show you a variation of the trick I just taught using the silverware, changing a fork into a spoon or a spoon into a fork. This uses a straw. Now this one you can do at a fast food restaurant with a thinner napkin because um, it'll hide the straw a little bit better. Same principle, only here's what I do. I tell a little story about the straw being cold. I take the top of the straw off, get rid of it and take the straw out of the packet without ripping it. The straw lays down on the napkin. Its little coat lays down on the napkin too. Grab them both, roll them up, same way we did before. Same trick. Now when I open it, the straw is now wrapped back up in its little sleeve. Ooh, a miracle. Shh, don't tell. The straw trick works on the same principle as the fork and spoon trick. Here's what you need. You need two straws. One is underneath, still in the wrapper with just the tip of it torn off. That's all. Just tear off the little tip there. Lay that in the middle. That goes on top. You pick up another straw, you open that straw, set it down on the table with the paper. Same thing as the fork. We pick them up and roll them and do the flip. You're here, two triangles, you flip, you pull, and the straw is dressed again. Very, very easy to do. Now, let me give you a few tips. Um, you can do this with pretty much anything you can think of. Just use your imagination. You can change a pen into a pencil. You could change um, a carrot into whatever isn't a carrot. Uh, you could change your money if you wanted to. Um, it's all the same principle of that rule because all you're doing is flipping the napkin over. Very, very easy to do. Uh, use your imagination. Come up with some cool things that you could do with that. Have fun.